Hello and welcome to Arful Motors in Wigan. Today I've got the absolute pleasure of showing you around this 69 plate on a 19 Alfa Romeo Giulia Super Auto. The car itself is finished in this lovely dark metallic grey which really shows off the lines of the vehicle and the curves. Uh, but taking a closer look at the front, you've got this lovely honeycomb style grills which give off a real mean appearance to the car. You've got front fog lights and the lovely chrome detail in, in the centre grille. Looking down the side of the vehicle, it's free from any major dents, dings, scrapes, bumper corner scuffs and it really is a fantastic car. These are an absolute delight to drive through the automatic gearbox. Uh, they really are something to rival the BMW 3 Series. Looking at the alloys then, we're riding on these lovely 17 inch grey metallic wheels with the grey Alfa Romeo uh, brake calipers which really do fill the, the wheels nicely. Again looking down the side of the car, you can tell it has really been cherished by its former keeper. All the alloys are in lovely order and free from any major scrapes or scruffs. Looking through to the rear, we have this uh, lower diffuser with a single exit tailpipe, uh, rear parking sensors and LED rear lights. Coming through to the boot, you can tell it's a really big boot space with it being a saloon. Um, like I said, loads of space for prams, shopping, things like that. Looking under the boot mat, that's where the locking wheel is, your tow uh, hook and any essential things like your tyre well. Looking down the passenger side, again it's all in really nice order, free from dints, scrapes, anything major. Looking at the door edges, they're all in lovely order and free from carpet chips and dings. Again, looking at the alloys, they're all in fantastic order and riding on Michelin tyres all round. But looking on to the interior of the vehicle, <coughs> you get this lovely half leather cloth interior, which again is super comfortable with a side bolster to give real support when driving. And a nice little feature is the Alfa Romeo embedded on the headrest. But again, looking round, it is all in lovely order. Looking at the steering wheel, it's free from visible ring scratches and very, very hard use wear, so it's free from all that. But as we jump in there, as we are doing the video today, the car has only covered when it loads in a second. We'll get back to that in a second. But looking at the specification wise on the vehicle, it's got electric mirrors, four electric windows, auto lights, front and rear fog lights. But again, looking at the steering wheel, it's a lovely flat bottom steering wheel. I like the added feature of the start stop button there. It really is a, a lovely steering wheel to feel and it's a lovely cockpit to be in driving. You've got cruise control on the steering wheel and on this side you've got voice command, your volume up and down and answering the phone. Taking a look at the indicator start, you have uh, lane keep assist, again which shows up on the top there and you've also got added auto RB. But back to the mileage, as we do the video today, it's only covered 18,236 miles. But again, a really nice place to be. If you look at the passenger seat, that again is free from any heavy wear or tear. And as we look through to the rear, the back seats have they've hardly been sat in. They are free from minimal wear. You've got Arsafix and comfortable seating for free with the free seat belts. Moving back to the radio, it's uh, this. It's all entertained on this dial here, so that controls the full radio. So looking through to the radio. We've got full DAB, so you've got all the extended channels. Media, connected device, so you've got USB input and via Bluetooth music as well. Phone again, there you go, it's got full hands-free connectivity. Navigation wise, you've got the full sat nav, which is all clear and very responsive to use it. Really, it's not the worst sat nav to have, it's really quite responsive. Car settings, so you've got your car status there, which shows you all your tyre pressures, maintenance, and oil level, which shows. 
through to settings then you can alter your lights in the car follow me home coming home lights and many things like that with the settings but again looking at the climate control now it's full dual zone climate so the passenger can alter the, t the temperature different to the driver and then looking through to here now you've got your automatic gearbox which can go into manual mode looking for here you've got two cup holders and again you've got the driving modes here of dna so which we put it into drive that makes everything go red on the clock so that's your dynamic driving mode you've got n which is neutral makes everything go blue and then a which is your all weather and eco type driving but again looking through to the center and rest that's all in good order no nicks or tears in that and then as we open it up you will find uh, a 12 volt power outlet two usb slots and an arc slot but yeah what a really really lovely car but again if you have any questions or would like an inquiry on the vehicle please give us an email at sales at alphamotors.co.uk or please give us a call on 01942 231123 then thank you for watching goodbye